Hello YouTube, this is Joshua Timbucket and welcome back to another video of Genshin Impact. In the last episode, we were able to meet the Moon Carver. Uh, and he was very disappointed with uh, Liu Wang Shi Shi? I can't even pronounce their names properly. Anyways, very disappointed in them because apparently Rex Lapis is actually dead. Crazy. Uh, so now we have to go find see we oh, we have to find the moon shaper see if we can actually meet this moon shaper uh, I, I don't know what's going on but uh, now we have to find this other entity of some sorts and what is that what is that better descend or I run out of energy what is this hey what was that Wait, what? You were hitting there all this time? Get out of here. Oh, don't mind if I do. Okay, I'm just gonna continue. I'll just continue forward. We have to go to this section here. To this area here. I will not get interrupted. We have to continue the story and see what happens. Oh, actually, we might ha we we can't go this way. It's way too high. Whoa! I guess we have to take the this passage here. I guess I'll fight you guys. What's here? Ooh, there's something I could acquire there. But do it some other time, though. Not right now. We need to continue the story. I'll do it. I'll do it later. I'll do it off. Um, off recording. All right, so we're almost there. Let's see what happens. I'm very interested to find out exactly what's going on here. Right. Oh, another treasure. Wait a minute. It was a trap this whole time. They're immune. What am I doing? Oh, except for this guy. All right. Here we go. Brace yourselves. Brace yourselves. Yeah. I don't know what I'm trying to do here. Excuse me. Just trying to break this. Thank you. Okay. Looks like rock candy or something. All right, here we are. Quest. Quest. Quest area reached. I kind of wanted to say reach and quest at the same time. So is this it here? Mysterious barrier. So, yep. UN Karst is where the Adapti dwell. So perhaps this is the uh, Dobe of One. But there seems to be no way to enter. Hmm. What about with my thing? The, the thing that um, Tartaglia gave me. Oh, how's it going, dude? Treasure hoarder. Have mercy, almighty oh Adeptus. I beg you, show mercy upon me and my brother. Spare our lives. Who are you? What's going on? We asked you first. Yeah. Oh, you enjoy safe passage in Joyun Karst. It can only mean one thing. You must be Adepti messengers. Is sent here to rescue me and my brother. What is he talking about? Mm. Oh, have mercy, mighty messengers of the illuminated Adepti. I beg you to save us. My brother and I, we only came here because our family is poor. And we heard tell of treasures hidden in the amber of Mount Hulao. It was stupid of us. But all we wanted to do was to find enough treasure to sell and support our family. 
We followed the path up the mountain, but suddenly, the amber that swallowed up my brother Li Dang. I ran away and made it this far before it dawned on me. We were trespassers in the abode of the Adepti, and this was our punishment. I had no idea how to rescue my brother, so I just started praying for the Adepti to have mercy right here on the spot. And now, that long last, two messengers come to my aid. What? We're not Adepti messengers. We just want to find the Adepti like everyone else. No, 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 you, you must be messengers. You have to be. I have no idea which Amber trapped him. Please, you have to rescue him. I beg you, show me some Adepti mercy. Thank you, thank you. Oh, mighty messengers of the Illuminated Adepti. I promise it's that a we trap, will never isn't it? be so foolish again. So he's trapped in one of these I things, right? I was gonna ask him about where to find the Adeptus, but he seems pretty one-track mind about rescuing his brother right now. Hmm. So, he said that Lee Dang got trapped in Amber somewhere on Mount Hulao, and that they were following the path the whole way up. Yes, yes. So let's follow the path down from here, and make sure to be on the lookout for Amber on the way. I mean... I don't think that was the quest that we were on. <laughs> I don't think so. But uh, apparently that's what we have to do now. Huh. All right, where would the where would his brother be? Is he hidden here? Is he trapped here? Hello, brother guy. Oh, that's a big boy. Okay, let's take care of him. I didn't do anything. Stop! Stop! I can't see. You shall fall. Get out of here. Bye. Have a have a good one. All right. Are you here? Bye. You you came back for me. All right. Um Can you be here, dude? Come on, please, please be here. No. Bye. So he's in one of these, huh? I'm so sorry, little dude. No. I refuse to fight you. There he is. All right, let's talk to Lee Dang. <coughs> what happened? You, you rescued me. Oh, thank you. Oh, and have you seen my brother? His name is Lee Dang. We were climbing the mountain together. I just hope he didn't get trapped in Amber too. Phew. So he's safe then? Oh. Oh. Thank you. I will head up to find my brother now. Get out of here. I don't run into any more Amber on the way. Get out of here. I thought it was uh, Candy Rock. All right, let's talk to these Thank dudes. Thank you for rescuing my brother, oh mighty messengers of the Illuminated Adepti. Here they what? go again. No. I mean, like everyone else, we've heard that there's an Adeptus living in Mount Hulao. Regular folks like us would never have the chance to meet them. No way. Unlike you guys, you're Adepti messengers. So it's a whole different story. Anyway, we have trespassed in the realm of the Adeptus for long enough. We should get going. Thank you, mighty Adepti messengers. Yes, thank you. Boy, it's 
it'd be super helpful if we actually were Adepti messengers. Cause it seems like this Adeptus has got a real temper problem. But it's not like we've done anything wrong, so... Oh. Who dares trespass on my mountain? She was right. Who Wait, I'm not pressing anything, guys. Foolish mortal. Come forth and receive your punishment. I'm not pressing anything. I was trying to listen to that. All right, here's the mountain shaper guy. You intrude upon the sanctity of Mount Hulao. You destroy the amber of my mountain. And you free a thief whose freedom is not yours to give. Okay, I'm not going to use the start autoplay because it doesn't seem to work at the moment. So I'm just going to The thieves' do it myself. ignorance was an affront to the Adepti. But your actions are an abomination of the <gasps> highest order. Oh no, I'm sorry. Wait, we can explain! Um... Here, look at this. A sigil of permission. One was unaware that such things still exist in the mortal realm. In the beginning, Rex Lapis cast them for the mortals with his own hand. Few were made then. And thousands of years on, fewer still remain. Speak. One shall listen to the matter which brings you here. Then one shall verify the truth thereof. You would be wise to speak the truth. For Liyue is not so far from here that one would be easily deceived. You explained what happened in Rex Liyue Harbor. Lapis assassinated? Oh no! It can't be! At the right of dissension? <gasps> that makes it even worse. What mortal in Liyue, nay, in all the world, would conspire to commit such foul treason? Or perhaps the more pertinent question is, what power in this world could aspire to achieve it? Rex Lapis charged the Adepti with the protection of Liyue, and we have always honored this duty. As the people have prospered, so have we gradually withdrawn into the mountains. Indeed, this was a gesture of goodwill towards humanity. But now, alas, Rex Lapis, gone. Traveler, of the matter you have relayed, one has become aware. One now knows why Moon Carver has sent for us. Once one has dealt with certain matters here that require my attention, one shall convene with the other Adepti. Paimon can! Adepti always have magical powers in storybooks. Seems it's true in real life, too. You know, like how grass is actually Adepti hair, and rivers are actually Adepti saliva. There must be something similar going on with the amber. <laughs> Your nonsense knows no bounds. This amber is produced by a flower that one has planted here, called the Karst Crawler. I, I didn't say the amber was poop. I, I didn't say it. The majority of the plant is hidden underground. When stepped on, it produces amber to trap the invader. After taking up residence here, one planted many karst crawlers to ensure that the tranquility of the mountain would remain undisturbed. Over the years, they have helped to prevent many disturbances. But in the process, they have also trapped many curious things. Oh, so the amber is alive? Correct. Thus, one may not leave this place in its current state for fear of the risk to innocent lives in one's absence. One will depart as soon as one has attended to this matter. One trusts that the manner of your departure will be swifter in nature.
we've completed the quest. Now, where do we have to go? Mount Aozang? Aozang? I have, I'll have to see how to pronounce it. Anyways, I'm going to go to the end of the video there. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, go ahead and hit that like button. The like button and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.